ecstasy. In any city, in any country, go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself to. Approach the front counter with a look of determination on your face. Ask to see the holder of ecstasy. The attendant will not acknowledge you immediately. Instead she will wake as if from a stupor, her arms sliding across the counter, and she will amble down a previously unseen hallway. Follow her. The corridor will twist and turn, seemingly in impossible ways. You will notice the air will become more humid, the hall becoming brighter, although no source of light is apparent. You will be shown a door, slightly ajar, and the attendant will shuffle off without a word. Push open the door, ignoring its slimy coating. Inside this room will be a brilliant white light, as bright and as high up as the sun. The walls will be lined with a floral print. The floor will be neatly trimmed grass, and standing prominently in the center of the room is what looks like a large flower bud, about half your height. An elderly man will be sitting in the corner, eyes closed. He will not notice you or interact in any way, save for responding to the question, What if it dies? The man will stand, walk to the plant in the center, feel for the tip of its bud, and tear off a piece. Sound will now cease. No scream may leave your mouth. No clap of your hands will be heard. Even the voice of your own thoughts will be pushed out. After a few moments, a deep vibration will enter your mind. Suddenly, like a boom of thunder, the world around you will shake and rumble as every physical pleasure imaginable engulfs your senses. Your eyes will roll back and you will fall to the floor writhing in orgasmic joy. You must reject these feelings, lest you will lay on the floor of that room until you die from dehydration. You must imagine only the worst pain you felt. Dig your nails into your chest, scratch at yourself until you focus only on the pain. The vibrations will stop, and you will stand. Inside the tear on the flower is a seed. Take it, leave the room, and make sure to focus only on your discomfort. The seed is object 187 of 538. Plant it or not, the choice is yours.